guys what is up welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here my name is Romary and I make a lifestyle content here on YouTube and I upload weekly so make sure to like subscribe and comment down below and turn those post notifications on so you don't miss out on any updates from me I've never made a Q&A on my channel but I think it is the right time to finally make one now that I'm at almost 450 subs so that you guys can get to know me as a person it is literally incredible how fast I have grown in just a matter of like a couple of months. So for today's video, I'm gonna be doing a Q&A and get ready with me. So I'll be doing my natural glam for today and answering some questions. I'll probably throw in some juicy ones here and there, so stay tuned for the tea. So let's get on to the video. So I will be reading the questions off of my phone. So if I'm looking down a lot, that's why. <laughs> so I'm gonna be starting out with my primer. So I use the Hourglass Veil Primer and I pretty much just put that on my face after I've moisturized, done the whole skincare routine, you know the deal. What's really cool about this is that it has some SPF in it so I don't have to worry about like SPF coverage, which is super nice. So for the first question, it's where are you from? So I am originally from San Diego. I was born and raised here. And I'm currently back here right now, which is so nice because it's the summer and it's super hot. So I went to the University of San Francisco for college, um, but I did graduate in three and a half years. So I guess you could say I'm smart. I absolutely love San Francisco. I miss it so much, but I'm not sure if I would go back right now. At least I love the sun down in SoCal a little bit too much. <laughs> and so next I'm going to be taking my foundation. I use the Too Faced Peach Perfect Comfort Matte Foundation. It's honestly a pretty light to medium coverage, so which is why I use it for like my natural makeup. Um, and I don't use it all over my face. I really just use it on like problem spots, so like red spots and then like any pimples I have. I literally just grab like a tiny little bit and just kind of like dab it on my face. So for the next question, it is, how old are you? So I just turned 22, it's my T-Swift year. Um, my birthday had just passed, it was on July 30th, and I had a low-key celebration here with my family. We literally had a carne asada because we are Latino, so that was super fun, that's all I wanted, just some quality time with family. And then for the next question, it is, what is your astrological sign? So I am a proud Leo. I absolutely embrace that. I love everything astrology. I definitely love the fierceness of Leos and it's something that I feel like I have in my personality. So love being a Leo. If you're a Leo, let's connect. Let's be best friends, best kind of people. <laughs> and then for the next question, just because I've been getting a lot of comments about this on my previous videos, everyone is wondering what the heck this is on my face. Some people are like, oh my god, are you okay? Like, did you hate yourself? Do you have a bruise? Like, what's going on? And just so that you all know, I'm absolutely fine. There's nothing wrong with my face. It's not a bruise. I literally popped out the womb and it was just on my face. So uh, that's cute. And apparently it was supposed to go away when I was 18, but that never happened. So it's still there. I honestly forget it's there sometimes, but I do cover it up with like, very light makeup. I don't cover it up completely just because I do feel like it is a part of me and I don't know, it's like my signature thing to everyone I know. So I, I embrace it, I love it. So then next I'm gonna go and find Too Faced Concealer. I've literally had this thing forever, so it's like super faded, but I love it. I'm almost out of it, so I need to buy some more. And it's in the shade Nude. So I take this and I literally just apply a little bit like right here, right there, and then up here. I'm kind of doing that TikTok thing that apparently makes your eyes look snatched. I don't know if that's true, but I guess we shall see. I use my hand whenever I do natural makeup just because I don't really feel a need to use a beauty blender. Like, So then for the next question, um, I have gotten some questions about this and some people are wondering what the story behind my name is. So a lot of people have told me they've never heard the name Romary and they're always like, is it Rosemary, Rosemaria? So my name is pretty much a ship name before ship names were even a thing. My parents literally were so confused on what to name me. They were like, should we name her this? Should we name her that? I don't know. My mom had just given birth and they were like, hmm, maybe we should combine both of our names. So my dad is Robert and my mom is Maria. So they decided to combine the names and create Romary, <laughs> which is honestly so creative if you ask me. Like, I would have never thought to do that. And next I take this lip and cheek tint from Milk um, and it's in the shade Rally and I just kind of like put it on my face as blush. So I'll kind of go ahead and do that. 
I look like a clown, but whatever, it's fine. <laughs> and then for the next question, it is, what are my hobbies? So I feel like I have a bunch of different hobbies, but I would say that my main ones for sure are art, I love to paint, I love to sketch, draw, all of that. And I've always loved to do that since I was like literally born. <laughs> and I've also loved photography, so I have a really nice camera for that and I go out and take pictures. And I also love photography and video making, filmmaking, which is why I started my YouTube channel. I film on a Canon Rebel T3i and it's been great. I'm using it for photography, for YouTube, so I love it. It's definitely one of my hobbies. I love to be outdoors, so I love to go hiking with my friends, go to the beach, surfing, cliff jumping, whatever that is. I'm super adventurous and I love to do all of that. And then I also love shopping. I'm constantly shopping for new things. And then next I'm gonna go in with my blush. So I use a Sephora blush and it is in the shade Los Cabos. And so I'll take this, dab it off a little bit and then like just apply it to my cheek, you know, from the top of your ear and down. And so for my next question, it is what are some of your favorite clothing stores? So this might be a little bit controversial, um, but I absolutely love Brandy Melville. I know, don't come for me guys, please. Like, I know, super controversial and they clearly prefer one type of model. I'm not gonna say what that is, but you know, definitely not what I look like at all. And then I also absolutely love Urban Outfitters. This shirt is actually from there. It's so cute, it has like skeletons on skateboards and it's literally like, the cutest thing. I also love Zara, Topshop, Nordstrom. And then for my favorite online store, I'm a huge fan of Pretty Little Thing and Princess Polly. Get a bunch of my pieces from there. So highly recommend those stores. Shipping time is so fast and they have a great customer service. I love them. And so now I'm gonna go with my Laura Mercier translucent powder and put it on the under eye area of my face, as well as like right here to carve out my cheeks. So then for my next question, it is, what are your favorite YouTubers? So I spend so much time on YouTube. I love people like Lauren Geraldo, James Charles, Amanda Diaz, Nicolette Gray. I also love Keaton Milburn. Oh, I also love Sierra Furtado. I met her at Coachella, her and Tila Dunn, and they were literally the sweetest people ever. Also so weird, but I absolutely love Faze Rugg and his brother Broadus just because they're from San Diego and they make such entertaining content. It's a lot of like challenges, prizes, money, all of that. So definitely love them, which is so random for me. So now that I have put translucent powder on my face, I'm gonna go ahead and start doing my eyebrows. I'll probably just do one on camera and then the other off camera to just save time. <laughs> so then for eyebrows, I use the Anastasia Dip Brow Pomade and it's in the shade Dark Brown. And I take the Dip Brow on this brush from Sephora. It's the Sorolis Precision 20. So the next question is, do you have any pet peeves? I have so many pet peeves, but I would say one of the weirdest ones is I hate being able to hear people chew. I think it's literally so disgusting and it's just it's just gross I hate like sitting there and it's kind of like silent for a second and then you just hear like the like the chomping sound it's disgusting I hate it and I just hate people that are liars disrespectful and fake I value my friends so much and if I'm gonna spend time with someone I definitely want them to bring positive into my life and not negative so I'm not afraid to cut a bitch and move on with my life. <laughs> so now that both of my sister brows are on because they're definitely not twins, um, I'm gonna go ahead and take the concealer again and just put some on my hand to then carve out my brows and just really give them that defined look. And so for the next question, it is, what is your favorite place in the entire world? There is definitely one place that literally has stolen my heart and that is Cartagena, Colombia. Everyone is so friendly and the vibes are just immaculate. <laughs> Honestly, it's such a great place to be in. They're so hospitable, like they literally will offer you their life. They are amazing. I love Colombians. I would absolutely love to go back because I am Mexican and Colombian. So then once my eyebrows are carved out, I'm gonna take some more concealer, put it on my lids and have that as a base for my eyeshadow. And so once I put concealer all over my eyelids, I know I look a little bit scary right now. I'm gonna go in with my Morphe James Charles palette and start creating a look. So as a base, I take Punch Me and I put it all over my lid. And then for the next question, it is, what are your goals in life? So one of my biggest goals in life is to be successful and financially stable while also doing what I love. So I really hope that YouTube takes off and that I can 
provide for myself with YouTube just because I absolutely love doing this and I love making videos and content for you guys and editing and everything which sounds crazy but I literally love it but then I also love things like design and marketing and all of that so I would also love to have a career at a really big firm or something doing stuff like marketing or design or something like that just because I feel like I am super creative and so now that I've put that light shade of punch me on my eyelid I'm gonna go ahead and take the shade code James and just put it lightly on like the base of my eyelid and then blend up and then for the next question it is do you have any siblings so yes I do have siblings I'm the youngest of six they are definitely a lot older than me and have kids and everything so I am an aunt which is awesome overall just a really great family and I love them all so much and so that is as much as I'm gonna do just because this is like a natural look and I don't want to go too overboard I just want to give it like a nice little bronzy type of look and so now that that is all done I'm gonna go ahead with my glow kit from Anastasia and I'm going to highlight my face. So I'm going to take the shade Bubbly and just dip into it and just highlight right here on the high points of my face. For the next question, it is, do you have any pets? So I did have a pet um, of 14 years, but she recently passed away in March, which was really sad. Um, she had cancer and her tumor ruptured, and it was pretty much like a lost cause at that point because the, the cancer had spread and she was bleeding internally. So we had to put her down, unfortunately. And that was really sad so if you guys know what it's like to lose a pet I literally would not wish it on pawn anyone it is the worst thing that anyone could go through it's just so sad but now I have my beautiful little corgi and I'll insert a little picture of her right here because she's sleeping right now and her name is Maui and I just got her last month and I'm so happy with her she's the best puppy so now I'm gonna go into my bronzer again and just use this little brush that I have as you guys can see to contour my nose a little bit and for my next question, it is, what are your favorite foods? So I am a huge fan of Mexican food. I absolutely love Mexican food. It is the greatest. I can have tacos every single day, all day. And then I also really love Asian food. So that could be literally from any culture, whether it's Thai food, Chinese, Japanese, literally anything I will eat that's Asian food. Like it is just delicious. And then I also love burgers. <laughs> I'm a huge fan of burgers. I could go for a burger at any time. I think they're literally so good. <laughs> so now that I've contoured my nose a little bit, I'm gonna go back in with my Anastasia Glow Kit. And with my finger, I'm gonna take the shade Bubbly and just apply it on the tip of my nose to really just give that button nose look like that. And then right here, like down the bridge of my nose, I think it's what it's called. And then also on my eyebrow bone a little bit like that. And then I'm done. So before I put on lashes, I love to go into my Morphe spray. I'll just take that and just spray it all over my face like this. <laughs> now that my face is dried and everything from the setting spray, I'm gonna go ahead and curl my eyelashes. I usually put my falsies on first before mascara just because I feel like whenever I put mascara and then the falsies on, it's just harder for me to put them on. And then for the next question, it is what are your favorite TV shows? I love Keeping Up With The Kardashians, Jane the Virgin, The Bachelor, Bachelorette is literally everything. I love that. I love Botched, which is this plastic surgery show. And then I also love to watch Selling Sunset on Netflix. So I went ahead and put some duo glue on my hand and then I'm gonna go ahead and apply that to the lashes. I am using these lashes, which are the Ardell Faux Mink Wispies. And so while I wait for these to dry, I'm gonna go ahead and answer another question. For the next question, it is what is your favorite music genre? So to be honest with you, I listen to all different types of music, but lately I've been so into Latino music, so like reggaeton, so I'll listen to people like Bad Bunny, J Balvin, Maluma, Lunai, literally you name it, I am probably listening to it. I also love EDM and house just because in SF, that was like a huge culture thing and like everyone listened to EDM and house so it like really got me into it. Some people I love in the EDM world are people like AC Slater, Dom Dalla, Chris Lorenzo, Diplo, Chris Lake, EDX, Loud Luxury, Griffin, Calvin Harris, just to name a few. <laughs> and then I also really love vibey music. So people like, for example, Frank Ocean, Daniel Caesar, Mac Iris, 
Khalid, FKJ, Bruno Major, Pink Sweats. Sorry, I'm just looking through my list right now because I'm so bad at like recalling off the top of my head. And so then to apply my lashes, I use tweezers and I kind of just place them there. And then once I have the position down, I like to go ahead and take the tweezers and just kind of press both my real lashes and the fake ones together to just really make them stay. So once the lashes are on, <laughs> I love to take some mascara to just kind of blend together both lashes and make it look natural. And then I love to use a CoverGirl Lash Blast Waterproof Volume Mascara. I have tried every single mascara there is, but this one is just still my favorite. Every other mascara just makes them droop down and just like look clumpy, but this one keeps them pretty curled and just nice and sticking up. So I definitely recommend. So I'm just gonna take a little bit like that and apply it to my lashes. For lips, I usually take a gloss on Natural Glam Days. I either use a Fenty Beauty Gloss in the shade Fenty Glow, or I will also use the Dior Lip Maximizer Hyaluronic Lip Plumper. This one is not as intense as a Too Faced lip injection one, but it's just like a nice little gloss to put on your lips that might give it a slight plump, but nothing crazy. And then as I apply my lip gloss, I'm gonna answer one last question. And that question is, what is your favorite personality trait? And I would definitely say that I am a huge people person and I love to form relationships with everyone. And I feel like I can talk to anyone that I want to just because I feel like I am so open to everyone. I just love to learn about people's opinions, values, and all of that. It's just interesting to me and I love to just form connections with everyone. And so the look is now complete. So this is my summer everyday 2020 glam look and I absolutely love it. So thank you guys so much for watching this video. I hope you guys got to know me a little bit better and I cannot wait to learn more about you guys. So let's keep the fam growing. So make sure to subscribe and comment down below a unique fact about yourself. I'll catch you guys in the next one. Bye.